you were there as well. I mean, yes, I was there. We missed Senator Wamatangi and mm. uh, yeah. really hoped that uh, he would be there. So we would also hear his voice on these matters, but he has uh, spoken to them and we're looking forward to getting Governor Mutua's uh, book, uh, a call, because we all want to, you know, get there. So reprint, uh, let's, let's have copies, let, let mm -hmm. our young people have copies of this very important yeah. publication. And it's really stories of, and, and this is part of the discussion that was in Moranga, yeah. that this thing of a hustler nation, we don't want a nation of hustlers because we want people to move from where they are to the next level. Yeah. You know, we don't, we don't want to stick to where we are forever. People start somewhere. And that's the story that Governor Mutua is telling. Start from somewhere, you grow, and once you grow, you can tell the story of sheer hard work, yeah. you know, honest living, yeah. and no shortcuts, mm -hmm. you know? Because we don't want, you know, people to say, oh, I was selling chicken. Okay, you are selling chicken, and now today you are this, or, or, or what I had the other day that I was selling sweets. So how do you have 12 billion in your account? Because I was selling sweets and, and organizing discos in, in campus, you know? So yeah. we don't want this kind of, you know, Simon Maconde stories of, you know, today you're this. We want to see stories like what SK Macharia told. Yeah. It was moving because he said, my older sister is seated there. She didn't go to school because I had to be educated. And I walked nine months journey to get myself to the United States of America. And, and, and studied and came back and built an empire from scratch. And there were witnesses, you know, people like um, S.G. Tuju who said, you know, when you started this newspaper, we were saying, what is this African doing? Start going into the business of Waindis. So this, these are the stories of growth yeah. that we had in Moranga that we want, to, we want to hear. We want to hear your path. We don't want to hear that today you are this, yesterday you are this, and today, suddenly, you are this, and we don't, we can't see that journey. We can't see it. Yeah. And 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 I think that was an important takeaway. But but Trevor, there were two uh, issues there, and one yeah. was the issue of schizer tunes, and and it was an example of how you know change in policy and focusing in the right place, just a small change in policy can make a big difference. Um, and, 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 and when artists had a discussion with, with, the, with the, the prime minister and the prime minister went ahead and had a conversation with the president and they agreed. And I was assigned to try and see how best to make sure we have a change that would then give the artists a better deal. And the artists have moved from 16% yeah. in, in Skizatune to 41%. That's big. Because if, if you have a Skizatune, you pay one bob every day, and there are 18 million, I have a schizer tune. Yeah. And I keep a schizer tune, not because of the telecom provider, I keep a schizer tune because of the artist. Yeah. I keep a schizer tune because the artist singing it is an artist I like, so I keep that schizer tune. And we pay one bob every day, and we are 18 million of us, which means every day, 18 million shillings is paid. So if an artist moves from 16 to 41%, it's significant, yeah. you know, it's really significant. And, and, and this is what we want. We don't want you to sit with that and tell them, tutafanya, tutatenga, tutafanya, tut do something that really makes a difference. And, okay. and we really thank the president and we thank uh, Right Honorable Ray Lodinga for what they did yeah. um, for the artists. But coming back to the political message that I had, I had, uh, and, and, and Senator Omatangi has said it, I had Mount Kenya leaders say, we will go in one direction. Yeah. We'll make a decision and we'll move in one direction. So I hope, I wish them well as they organize themselves in that manner. They said we don't belong to anybody, you know, yeah. so nobody should be, nobody should shy away and say that this place belongs to so and so, or like we have been scared, oh, this is a Tangatanga area, this is what. They said we come, they said to Baba, come and keep coming, talk to our people. Yeah. And that was also a message I had. And a significant journey, beginning of a significant journey was declared because yeah. Baba said we are beginning a journey of unity. Yeah. And, and the journey began in Moranga, and that's significant. And, and there were discussions around, you know, if debts are to be paid, yeah. then let's start with the oldest yeah. coming to the youngest. So, so, so that was also, a, you know, a debate there. Yeah. If you want to start paying debts, don't pay the one for 
uh, today and forget the one for 1963, forget yeah. the one for 202, forget. So I think that was all debate that I had. But us, yeah. it was there. Us, all we could do is to listen to, to what, what the conversation saying. was. We were there as witnesses, okay. but it's the Mount Kenya leaders mm -hmm. themselves that had a conversation yeah. that you know, was informing the nation what exactly is going on. All right.